came to LaGrange technically in 1982 at Grady Memorial Hospital. I'm a Grady baby. Graduated LaGrange High School, went to Hollis Hand, went to all the schools that my kids are going to now. In 1989, I had open heart surgery. A lot of people don't know that. I was born with a PDA, which is a, a small hole in your heart. I was premature. Then in 1991, I got hit by a vehicle. So I was like a child that my mom wanted to keep in a bubble. I was a miracle baby. Graduated high school. Went off to college at Auburn. Ended up having my daughter, my oldest one, Adriana Kendricks, my junior year of college, and decided to commute back and forth. Took 10 years to graduate from Auburn. Was disappointed, kind of disappointed myself having a baby before marriage, but that degree eventually came. So I ended up teaching as a paraprofessional at Weissville Road Elementary here in LaGrange. Ended up getting married to my husband. We've been together for 22 years, married for 17. So I married my high school sweetheart. Ended up having my second child, Addison, in 2011. So we have a big gap. And I would say those are my most highlighted things in my life so far. And the most would be in 2016, becoming the first African-American to open an insurance agency in True County area. So by doing that, I showed my girls that there's no racial boundaries, there's no feminine boundary. You can do whatever you wish to do. I think that was one of the highlights that I created for myself was not allowing statistics. I was a teen, well, I wasn't a teenager, but I was a young mom, wasn't married, and I didn't allow those to hinder where I was going. I'm a minister also at Smyrna Baptist Church. So it's a natural thing to be a part of the community. Just going out there and just putting myself out there. I, I'm a very introvert type person and it's hard to kind of network when you're kind of like, I don't want people in my business type thing, but I had to get over that because you want the community to know that you're here. I had to kind of start putting myself out there. Going to the events downtown, I'm visible. Like I sponsor the football games for LaGrange High every year. I'm the basketball team. I feed them every home game for the girls' basketball team. Twin Cedars, I sponsor their Christmas events this year. So LaGrange College, I sponsor a lot of their football events. So anytime someone comes and asks me that's gonna make LaGrange bigger, I'm there for the big picture, so yeah. I can't explain it. Like, I guess it started from, I talked about earlier, being born a miracle baby. My faith came from me seeing that throughout my journey in life that God still was loving me. He still cared for me. He still wanted the best for me, even when I didn't understand what the best was for myself. It made me realize that God wanted the best for me when I no longer cared about my failures and I saw that God loved me regardless of them. So I think my faith grew when I saw that the love that God had for me was bigger than the love that I had for myself. Smyrna Baptist Church, we're on Cameron Mill Road. I've been a minister for going on eight years now, eight years. I would say that seeing God grow through myself and my family has been the biggest faith builder for me. I've seen the city change in a positive way, just seeing the diversity of the branch. When I first opened up, I didn't join the chambers because I said that nobody looked like me. I'm gonna be honest with you, nobody looked like me in places that I would want to go. And so now I've seen the diversity that has come to LaGrange. LaGrange is so diverse, LaGrange is so welcoming. We've always felt like family. One of my teachers taught me, my mom, my dad. So LaGrange has always felt like home, but it was just the lack of diversity in the chambers, in the banking, in the places that everyone wants to feel welcome. So that's the thing that I've seen LaGrange grow in over the last 30 some plus years. So just the different businesses that's come here. My dad owned a church's chicken in Blimpy here in LaGrange and that was years ago. But just to see the different restaurants that we're growing, the different businesses that are coming, it's just basically where we have probably tried to get for years, we're seeing it come. And, and, and I can't imagine what it'll be like when my kids go off to college and come back. I'm McKenna Kendricks and I'm the story of LaGrange.